out with He Who Remains, AKA Jonathan Majors. Give it up. That was a Marvel reference. If you're cool, you got it. If you're not, you didn't. Um, anyone in this audience can tell you military families sacrifice a lot. That's never clearer than when we see the countless reunion videos that bring us to tears and really move us. And this next one is among the best. It starts with a high school football player on the sidelines after practice telling his teammates about his mom, who he hadn't seen in nearly a year, which is a long time, it's crazy. He had no idea she was right behind him. Somebody in my family that I respect is easily like, there's a lot of people, but I would say my mom because she's been gone for about a year in the military and she's gonna continue to work hard. I know what she's getting on. She is a hard worker. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's so sweet. We have Sammy and his mama, Hospital Corpsman, first class, Dr. Harrison, this right now. So meet Jonathan, y'all. How you doing? How you doing? I mean, yeah. Sammy, that was quite a surprise. First of all, way to catch him. Um, <laughs> it was just so touching, and you really had no idea that your mom was there, right? I had no clue. Oh, my Zero. God. Yeah. That, that, like, thank you for whoever filmed that. That was just pure happiness and joy, and oh, what were you thinking whenever that happened? I was just like, who's behind me? Because my dad, he had a camera, um, like, when, we, when I went up. Yeah. Because our coach, he normally uh, brings up three people on our team to talk about like either somebody we respect or someone who we look up to. And I chose to love talk this about coach. My mom. I chose to talk about my mom, and next thing you know, I turned around, she was behind me. Oh my gosh! And Terry, you hadn't seen him? Is it nearly a year? Yes. So um, I'm originally stationed in San Diego at the hospital, and I've been in for 14 years active duty. Mm -hmm. So when I left him, uh, I was gone for eight months in Africa. We hadn't been uh, apart that long before, maybe five months at the most. But then once I mm -hmm. saw him and uh, my husband, he put the whole thing on, and he was like, we're going to surprise him. And I said, OK, let's do it. I love that. What a beautiful moment. And I can't, I'm a mama. I have a little son, a six-year-old. I'm like, oh my god, that's so many months, right? So I can't yes. even imagine that kind of hug, which is why you caught him. Um, <laughs> so Jonathan, what kind of feelings do you get when you see these reunion videos? I think they're just so magical and powerful. Tell me your first name again. Terrica. Terrica. Yes. Because my mama's name is Terry. Ah, nice. And uh, that's what I thought. Like, oh, wait. Uh, bro, you got a super mama. I know. Yeah. And that's your superpower, man. Yeah. And uh, when I saw that, I, I, I mean, it breaks my heart in the best way, yeah. you know, to see and to feel, you know, that it's, unity. it's, it's yeah. important, man. It's, it's yeah. Important. Yeah. yeah. And to be so proud of her and talking yeah. about her when you didn't even know she was there. I did it. That's what I would have loved as a mom. I'm like, he better say my name. <laughs> <laughs> that mention me at least. <laughs> well, I, I think everyone in this room understands the sacrifice that you've made to serve our country. Thank yeah. you so much. But you say that it's not just about sacrifice, right? Or it's not just your sacrifice. Absolutely. So I think the audience will agree with me when it comes to being away from your family like we've legit moved every three years since I've been in and they have to go to different schools my daughter she's in college now she had to do it he has to do it my husband he's at home mm. you know with them all the time that can I be love hard. that man to death because he holds it down when I'm gone mm. yeah so, yeah like, I moved around when I was a kid, too. That can be hard, man, to, like, recreate, like, all your friendship. Luckily, you're at least a generation of social media. You can still, you know, call previous yeah. friends or whatever. But, but that is kind of tough, right, to move around a lot? Yeah. Yeah. Like, just building new bonds and relationships everywhere you go. But it really builds up social skills, so. But I literally just said this to yeah. someone. I was like, I had to move around a lot, but I think it's almost like a superpower. It made me really comfortable in any room I walk into. Mm -hmm. it, yes, you know, it kind of forces you to be adaptable. So it's kind mm -hmm. of a superpower. Like, it will also prepare you to be a uh, working actor. <laughs> <laughs> he would, no. <laughs> He's like, so, um, Sammy, have, how have things been since your mom came home? Is it cool? It's, it's amazing. Ever since my mom's been home, it's like the family bond that we had, it never left. Because... Go right back to... It's right back to stage one. Because it's uh. just amazing. It's just amazing. I, I love you, too. Oh, my God, I hope my son's like you when he grows up. Um, <laughs> what, what do you want Sammy to know, Jonathan? At some point, you're going to leave the house, you know, and you keep her, you know, in your heart, you know, because there may be a time when you're away, you know, more than eight months, you know, without seeing your mama, you know. I've been on the road for a very long time, and I rarely see my mom, but I, I keep her in my heart. 
and, and you've already got it, you know. Uh, she is your hero, you know. Yes, sir. Yeah. That's well so done. cool. Yes, sir. Oh, well, I'm crying. It's fine. <laughs>